to another what we eat in a day video. As you can see, I already made my coffee. So I've really been liking the espresso blend coffee pods that are the Target brand. That's been my go-to. And I've just been using a little splash of almond milk in there as my coffee creamer. Uh, so you guys know the drill. I don't eat breakfast right away. So I'm gonna drink my first cup of coffee of probably two and I'll catch up with you when I have breakfast in a bit. made cup of coffee number two this time I went with the cinnamon I think it's just cinnamon it's the Target brand as well um, let me just check yeah naturally flavored cinnamon light roast coffee really like that one and the espresso one Anyways, I am um, hungry now, so I'm gonna have a granola bar. So, um, ignore the messy state of this, but I'm gonna grab Okay, so what I'm gonna have is this. This is a grain-free granola bar. The brand is Purely Elizabeth. The flavor is peanut butter cinnamon. And guys, this is delicious. I'm not sure if you can buy these in stores yet. I haven't seen them in a store, but I tried them several months ago and could not stop thinking about them. So I actually bought two boxes, one, two, um, from their website so that I could eat them but I think they're gonna be in stores this summer um, but anyways this is what I'm gonna have for breakfast hello hey have you had breakfast yet no that's what I'm coming out here to do oh Shelby thinks it's weird how much I like these no that's not what I said you make fun of me for how excited First I get about off, them don't worry about the planets on my face trying to sort that out we're just gonna brush past it and ignore it no I don't think you're weird I just she like went on and on about that like it so was the good. best thing she's ever had in her life and they're good it's the but best it's granola bar I've ever had in my life I've ever had it's not the life. best like food item I've ever had yeah I mean it's good it's nothing it's nothing like wrong with it Anyway, so this is what I'm gonna have for breakfast, and if you guys see these in a store, there's several different flavors. You should try them because they're really good. I'm trying to figure out what I want. I don't really have much. I'm going to the store tomorrow. I'm gonna have an apple strawberry bar. Gotta get that fruit in. Mm hmm Maybe oatmeal. I know it's lame, but I have one more oatmeal left. This home style gluten free oatmeal, and I will probably put a small scoop of peanut butter in. Well, there we go. That's what I'm at. I'm either wearing my Adele shirt or this One Direction shirt in every single video <laughs> because she only owns two shirts, and those are it. No, I own so many t shirts. I promise I wash them. I do. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. This is what's happening. Instant oatmeal. Not as good for you, but instant. <laughs> I put too much water and it turned out gloopy. Dang it. <laughs> oh well, it'll still taste good. And I got my fruit. It's 1 p.m. and I'm gonna run to the gym and I have to go to Whole Foods and get some groceries before I like really eat lunch. But I'm a little hungry, so I'm gonna have a little bag of these bare um, apple chips. 
These are really good if you've never had them. I actually prefer the cinnamon ones um, to just the plain ones, but we stole this bag from Create and Cultivate <laughs> and still have some. So I'm just gonna eat these. Um, I'm gonna go to Whole Foods and I probably won't have like a traditional lunch. Uh, I might pick up another snack or something at Whole Foods. Maybe some sushi. I haven't had sushi in a while. I don't know. We'll see what I end up doing. But I'm gonna eat this bag of chips, head to the gym, head to the grocery store, and then I'll show you guys what I get at Whole Foods when I get back. All right, I am back from the gym. I've showered. My hair's like soaking wet. But guys, I'm gonna cut it really short um, when I go home in June. So hopefully it's not gonna do this anymore. I don't know what pop-up's doing down there. It is smoothie time. Um, Ashley didn't want me to make her one because she just left to go to the gym and then she has to go to the store after that. I'm surprised she didn't take you guys with her. Maybe she can do a quick little haul of what she buys when she gets there. But, um, smoothies haven't changed except for I'm doing raspberries, blueberries, adding some strawberries. I have some spinach, um, almond milk, water. I'm going to put some flaxseed and maca powder. Um, the same vegan protein powder that we use and then we started using collagen peptides again. So that's my smoothie. Um, not sure what I'm going to have to eat. I'm not like starving, starving and since it's later, I probably don't want a lot. Um, I don't have any avocados. Usually I do avocado toast, but I don't have any avocados with me. So I'm going to have to figure that out. <laughs> I'll get back to you once I make my smoothie. All right, smoothies done. I found these in the freezer, so I think I'm just gonna heat these up just because it's quick and easy. Definitely not the healthiest and definitely not my first choice, but it's what I have. These cheese and green chili tamales from Trader Joe's. And then I picked these up randomly at CVS, but I thought they looked good. They're avocado ranch flavored tortilla chips with flax, quinoa, and chia, so I'm gonna have a few of those. That's gonna be lunch. All right, definitely not the prettiest thing I've ever made, but I'm excited to eat them. Got my chips, they're really good, smoothie. I'm gonna watch some YouTube videos. I'm back from Whole Foods, so I'm gonna quickly take you guys through what I got. I got some pretty flowers. They are really pretty. And they were on sale. Excellent. Here's my really long receipt. <laughs> I got some new stuff. Really? I know. I'm kind of just like. You never get new things. This is it now. It might be new to you guys though. I don't know that we've talked about this on a video. Whole Foods has these cauliflower pizza crusts. They're so good. They are delicious. Um, it tastes like an actual pizza crust. Like it's not like a flimsy like. It tastes like a thin crust pizza. Mm -hmm. Which is my preferred form of crust. That's not mine, but I'll take it. <laughs> um, they So it's made with cauliflower. There is egg in it. Um, and a little bit of cheese so it's not it's not vegan. vegan but it is gluten free um so anyways been picking one of these up shelby and i both have every time mm -hmm. we go and they have them because they sell out at our whole food so fast yeah so, um got an extra oh i might need to sneeze cauliflower rice i might use that for my dinner i got some strawberries strawberries now that it's warmer out i've transitioned to wanting like all fresh food. Mm -hmm. Not that I don't ever want fresh food, but you know, it's the time of year where you want like berries. And so I got that and some um, vegan whipped cream. I might do like strawberries and cream as like a little dessert. parfait. Maybe. I also got this to try. What is that? Cold brew. Um, it's a dairy free. I saw cold brew coffee. yesterday when I was at Whole Foods. Whole Foods brand, like the 365 brand. Yeah, almond milk. I almost Did you got see that? that? I, almost, I know, I've never seen that before. They had um, chocolate milk. and vanilla. Yeah. So, because we were talking without actually. <laughs> Whole Foods brand has um, their own line of um, dairy free ice cream. It looks like it's made with almond milk. There was a chocolate and a vanilla. Um, I didn't even realize we were doing that. <laughs> so, um, I tried. The cold brew, shh, I'm filming a video right now, hang on. <laughs> I tried the cold brew ice cream in that, what's that brand? Enchanted and... Enlightened. Enlightened, and it was really, really good, but it isn't dairy free. Yeah. So this one is cold brew coffee, dairy free, it's a coconut base. So I'm gonna try that. Salsa. I like this brand of salsa. 
It might just be local to our Whole Foods or like New York Whole Foods. Because it's Brooklyn. Because it's a Brooklyn company, but it's literally fresh. And like they rate on their like, like what batch. Oh, wow. And they, like it, this was literally made like by somebody and like put it yeah. on the store shelf. Um, it's, it's super fresh. So I doubt that it's other places, but I like it. I picked up a jar because they have these on sale. Oh, bless. Sitting right next to them. So, <laughs> you know, good merchandising, Whole Foods. Um, I got some tempeh. I got a lemon for Shelby. Mm -hmm. Pink. Well, I don't really have a place to put it. Thank you. She requested a lemon. I got myself some lemons and limes. And... Uh, I got this. This is like their fresh made Whole Foods. Some mango here. salsa. It's a pineapple mango jicama salsa that I'm probably gonna like put on some tempeh. Oh, interesting. Um, as like a, a topping and probably put that over. That's just venturing out. This, mm. um, which is just like a crispy kale. Slaw. Interesting. Which I I like kale, but I don't like messing with kale because the stems and <laughs> this look to be not stemmy. <laughs> so I can just like, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, some lemon hummus and some Daya jalapeno Havarti cheese because it was on sale. I don't really need it. What else? I got some mint that I'll probably do with my strawberries maybe. Um, or just put in water. It's my year I like mint and water. Like um, mint and lime just with some water. Nice and cold. <laughs> um, I got some more yogurt. You guys know I've been liking this lately. I'm not eating a ton of it, but just picked up a couple. I got some eggs because I think for dinner tonight I might do um, cauliflower fried rice. Interesting. This is your cilantro. Yep, you can just set it down. <laughs> I needed that for my dinner. And the last thing is these chickpea crisps that I'm gonna eat with this hummus. Uh, they got new packaging. Yeah, I saw. I like this. The brand is Saffron Road. This is the white cheddar flavor. They're little crisps that are made of lentils, peas, and sweet potatoes. Um, so it's all like plant protein. So that's what I got. Are you impressed? I am. Okay, I put my flowers in a vase. For lunch, I'm just gonna have a little, oh, hummus is falling. I'm gonna have some of these chips and hummus and some water that I just picked up at Whole Foods and I'll make my dinner a little bit early since I'm going light on lunch, but it is actually like 3.30, so it's kinda late. Don't wanna eat too much. Okay, I don't know where the heck this day has gone, but it is now 5.07 and I still have so much stuff left on my to-do list to do, so enter <laughs> coffee. Um, I have this vanilla chameleon cold brew. I'm gonna pour this into a glass with um, an ice cube, put a little bit of unsweetened vanilla almond milk in it, and that's my little afternoon treat because I need it because I still have so much to do. It's evening now, I just took a shower, hence why my hair's wet. And Shelbs and I are about to have our bi-weekly, bi-weekly? Two times a week, as told by meeting, where we just kind of catch up and download each other on what's going on. So I'm making some tea to bring to our meeting. What I'm making is this, it is from Trader Joe's. It is the mint watermelon flavored black tea. Um, I love mint tea. I love watermelon, and Shelbs brought me this back from Trader Joe's on a recent trip, and I really like it. So what I did is I brewed it hot, poured it in this glass over ice, added a sprig of mint, and a straw. <sighs> Tastes like summer in a cup. All right, for some reason I'm getting a really bad headache again. I think it's just from stress because I was just like booking a lot of things and like looking at dates and it was just like a lot but I'm having apricot LaCroix, it's my favorite flavor and I'm going to make dinner 
Ashley's mad at me, so I guess so is Pop Pop, but because <laughs> Ashley wanted to come eat, but I'm gonna cook quickly because I don't have a lot to cook. It'll be really quick. All right, so I have a bunch of leftover quinoa, so I'm going to get some of that out and mix in some pine nuts, lemon juice, black pepper, and some cilantro, and then cook up a few of these falafels to throw in there and top it off with some tahini. That's dinner finished. I'm not so good at the presentation, but it's gonna be really good. What are you doing? Call for Frederick. Oh, so, that's right. Um, what? You just be my camera person for a second. Oh, Let me jeez. Get <laughs> um, rice cauliflower. I have these frozen veggies I'm gonna use. She's like mix. Whoa. Don't mix spell vegetables. Those. I have some corn in there. Did you want There's corn? corn in here. Okay. And let's see. Pro tip. The cauliflower rice from Whole Foods is better than the one from Trader Joe's, just FYI. They're the same price, I believe, but I, the texture is so much better at Whole Foods. I'm gonna do some eggs, Jordan. I'm gonna use a little um, coconut aminos. Um, nice Turks and Caicos shirt. Thanks. <laughs> I think I'm gonna throw in some of this. The Interesting. Everything but the bagel sesame. Bagels, you yeah, do have sesame you. oil. It's up there. Way up there? Uh-huh. Uh, not worth it. If I have to get a stool, it's not it's not going in there. So um some variation of this. I might throw some other stuff in there that I find, but basically fried rice, but healthy. final product I added a little tofu in there and then I'm gonna drink this kombucha pineapple peach one of my faves dessert time I'll figure it out oh you're having cookie dough so I got this at create and cultivate on last weekend and it is fr um, from that place dough that <laughs> from that place dough the like cookie dough place here in New York they catered dessert so this is a little tub of cookie dough edible cookie dough and it's called brookie dough because I think it's a brownie and cookie dough mixed in one so I'm gonna eat this little couple bites for dessert you're rummaging maybe a few of these three too many no you know what I might do? Put them in the freezer really quick. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Frozen chocolate. I think that's what I'm doing. I don't know what's happening right there. <laughs> but we're going to go ahead and end this here. We're going to eat our dessert. And I just put mine in the freezer. Okay. Update. <laughs> Shelby's dessert is in the freezer. <laughs> Anyways, hope that you guys enjoyed watching what we ate today. Um, if you like this video and you want to see more, give us a thumbs up. Subscribe right there. And you can watch our latest video right there. <laughs> <laughs> Next time. Like Vanna Wyatt. <laughs> or like a flight attendant. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Bye. Bye.